The next course we're going to look at is the 10 kilometre event, which starts near the Wangaratta Kennel and Obedience Dog Club Club Rooms. An entrance will head straight out the northern gates of the showgrounds complex and turn right onto a section of gravel road and then grass. About 150 metres here in total before entrance merge into the sealed path and run all the way along this path until they get to College Street. A lovely section of pathway too. Run directly through the middle of the intersection at uh, Park Lane College Street and of course there'll be traffic marshals there to assist. An aid station will be set up just out the front of Allura Nursing Home there at about 1.7 k. Entrance turn right and run along Phillipson Street and half of Phillipson Street will be closed to traffic on the day. Turning left into Cambridge Drive and running along Cambridge Drive until they get to the designated turn spot. Make sure your bibs are showing so that our marshal there can uh, write down your number and that way we can be confident that you've completed the course. Entrance then turn around and run back along Cambridge Drive and back along Phillipson Street. Turning left into the path and back through the aid station at uh, the Allura Nursing Home on the pathway here at College Street. Entrance must always remember to keep to the left and that way there'll be no clashes with oncoming entrance. Turning left now onto the gravel section of path and running down into the Northern Beaches Complex. Entrance pretty much always enjoy this 1.2 kilometre section of uh, glorious unsealed track along the Ovens River. Going past some of the uh, beaches in here as well and also the Ogres Home, so be careful that those, uh, those guys don't come out and get you. And eventually pop up again onto the sealed path just near the back of the uh, Pump Shed Gun Club area there. Coming back to the showgrounds now, but uh, running straight past with the finish line on your right. Entrance will pop out at Evans Street, head down a steep concrete path and into the boat ramp section where they pass another aid station that will be fully stocked up with sports drink and water. On the same, uh, same basic course as the 5K is now, but we expect that pretty much the entire 10 kilometre field will be finished before the 5K is get underway. Over the first swing bridge, at the Ovens River and then running along paths adjacent to the Ovens River we go directly past the next swing bridge behind the back of the caravan park and pop out at Bickerton Street do a left hand right hand combination and run into Apex Park and then over the Wangaratta Park line start finish line and a bit further on until we get to Parfit Road run along the Parfit Road path and across the bridge and turn right into the Ovens River Boulevard and Boardwalk and charge along here as people are enjoying their morning coffee and in some cases a bit of breakfast or another snack. Down into Sydney Beach and over the Sydney Beach Swing Bridge and then follow the course all the way back over the second Swing Bridge through the boat ramp up the steep concrete path at Evans Street and then charging into the showgrounds complex with 300 metres to go and an ever so slight downhill. Entrance will enjoy this section Take a deviation to the right onto the grass where directed and finish at this fence line the 10 kilometre event. Grab your medal and celebrate your achievement. All of the details of the 10 kilometre event as well as the other events on offer are available at wangaratamarathon.com.au. Uh, entry forms are there as well and we do encourage early entry. That's wangaratamarathon.com.au.